Welcome to Sin Lighting and today we'll be talking about how or best practices you could observe in extending some of your gear's life. So I'll start from the smallest things, um, as simple as a tripod. So uh, this one. Sometimes on commercials and jobs, I'm probably not setting up the camera, I'm probably doing something else. Most of the times, camera assistants, first AC, second AC are the one who usually handles the camera. And this is a C700. They do a good job of putting together probably in this configuration or whatever configuration we desire. Then when you get the camera and you're supposed to pray, assuming it was a tripod, this happens. <laughs> so I'm, a lot of us are used to the notion of balancing runnings and balancing um, gimbals you get. But for your head, the fluidity and the longevity of your head determines how well you assign the load of a tripod like the way this has been balanced you could tell that it's back it happens a lot and most of the time they usually crank up the torque on the tilt to the seven which will slow down the drag or increase the drag so you it's still there but it's not that obvious and if this is done like i don't know over time you end up killing the fluidity of your head, which will end up damaging um, the entire tripod unit. Most type tripods are built like a tank, but it pays to know the right thing to do. And more so, if you have a tripod that cannot support this payload, every inch of where you put the load counts. We determine whether we have a very smooth tilt, a smooth pan, or a little bit jagged and a little bit jilting especially in those longer focal lengths so as simple as it is please balance the tripod and the first thing you could do about that is unloosing the tilt head like like i've done here which i can now see um, i will unlock the tripod plate and because i see it's falling back forward simple you know what we'll do right we'll push it forward so we'll push it forward till we can get it to like i don't know stay and stop tilting which is here in this place, as simple as one hand, tilting without any effort, coming down without any effort, as opposed to when it was backwards, you'll be the one who'll be using your own hands and your own strength actually tilted, which will lead to loss in fluid motion. And um, yeah, please, whenever you get your tripod cameras, um, try and balance out your rig, even if the lens is small. It goes a long way in getting great footage or getting the performance you desire so um, if you have anything you want to know about this camera or something else you want me to like to talk about before my next video whereby I'll break down lights and scenes let me know we could run tests we could run stuff we could go through this camera if you're interested in this camera we could talk about that whatever it is you want me to talk about so until next time balance your tripod where please don't break your lens please don't break your gear head and get the job done